just to keep it from not getting eroded. But oh well. People are stupid. People have been proving that for the last three fucking weeks. <laughs> My God. Jesus Christ. I thought the COVID virus or the Chinese virus was going to take care of that. It is. We've got 40 cases of, I think it was 42 cases of the virus today. We had 40 yesterday. I think we finally got people starting to die off. I think we've got six deaths already. So, sooner or later. Um. In general, as a whole, this RV park is kind of like this at night anyway, because the manager doesn't want you out making a fucking ruckus at night. Which makes it nice. You could spend all day at the lake and raise hell all you want at the lake and then come back to a nice, peaceful RV park. This is your ultimate gem of a find. You don't find that too much at RV parks. Um, some RV parks are just party havens, which I get that. You want to get away from home, have a fun time, and and get away from the city, and uh, bring the city out to the fucking woods. <laughs> so, but you forget the point of uh, coming out in a travel trailer to go RV and. Uh, the point was to get away from that crap. Get away from the city noise. Get away from the fucking traffic and the crazy people. Come out here to this. Quietness. The only thing you hear are bugs and far off traffic. And once in a while you might hear some air traffic. But San Angelo's airport really doesn't have a lot of air traffic commercial wise a lot of uh, private uh, jet companies out here flying and out flying people in and out with their private jets or they own their own private jet one or two um, the only commercial airline that flies in is the little American Eagle uh, unit flies in once in the morning once about 10 o'clock or 9 o'clock and after that it's pretty quiet but we do have the National Guard out here too that every two weeks out of a month or so they'll don their jumpsuits and start flying their Hueys and jets and having a good time in the air practicing so and that could be a little annoying, especially if you got a hot shot fucking F-16 pilot wanting to fucking go Mach 10 around here. It's like, what the hell? But that doesn't happen too often. Once in a blue moon, especially if the government shuts down. Seems like that's a free-for-all. Free They're like, alright, time to see what this baby can do. But thank God they're not sending sonic booms over here to shatter windows. The day that happens when I pull out my gun and start shooting down a fucking aircraft. It's like, oh, look, you little bastard. You just cost me a fucking couple of grand. I'll fucking look you. Cost the government a couple, couple billion. <laughs> like fuckers. fun stuff too much pipe tobacco I think I'm 
layer in my lungs full of freaking uh, tar and nicotine from the pipes tobacco the COVID wouldn't even have a chance <laughs> come back as a lung loogie like a whole shot don't See no deers, but they are sneaky little things. I walk right past it when you have your back turned around. You got a herd right behind you. Like oh, you know, that field right there usually has a handful in it. I don't see any. See what the babies are doing. They're probably right next to the door hunting bugs. Their light's starting to dim down. Oh, they're sitting in their nest just relaxing. But they're waiting. They're waiting. Big girls are like, what do you think we are, top lover? Behave, no squawking, no squawking. Too late for the squawking stuff. Those little wedge lights are solar motion lights, which was awesome. They work good. I turned off my motion light on my pole. I can turn it on before I go back in. And that works pretty good. But I think I'll have to change out my dust to dawn batteries. They're a couple years old now. So. And they only run on the little small dusted dawn lights that are on my garden fence post there. Um, they only take one triple R battery and they usually last for about a year or two. Winter time's hard on them. And I'll have to change out the batteries to my Christmas lights too. I'll probably do that around fall. somebody shooting deer or something towards that butte lake over there there's a lot of deer over there there's not a lot of people over there mm, gotta clean out the back there Go, my GoPro is an old Silver 3, doesn't have uh, zoom. I hear the new black uh, GoPros have zoom on them. Well, that's pretty sweet. But still, you're paying, paying $800 for a fucking wide angle lens camera with zoom abilities now. But I do love my GoPro, it's a pretty sweet little camera. Takes some good pictures. Makes some good little videos.
Well, I guess not much is happening right now. Might as well save my battery and stay out here for probably another hour or so. And uh, maybe if I see a deer or two, I'll be able to turn the camera on and get some deer footage. Alright, well, if anything exciting happens, we'll be back. Have a nice night, everybody. We'll talk to you later. Bye-bye.